In this lesson, we will discuss chapter number three, integration exercise three point two, question number one, part seven. And the question we have function of x equal to integral three x plus two whole divided by under root x and then dx. So see, this is three x plus two whole divided by under root x. It means this is square root, this under root x will divide 3x as well as 2 both. Right, so we will do like this integral of 3x by under root x, then plus 2 divided by under root x. This under root x will divide both. Here I will give you the simple example. Suppose I will say 1 plus 4. 4 divided by 5 which is equal to 5 over 5 or equal to 1 right if I will say that this 5 divides 1 and this 5 divides 4 as well so it will be 1 over 5 plus 4 over 5 individually but see the denominator is same we will take the LCM answer is exactly same so the same rule I am going to apply here this divided by two terms divided by under root x it means you have to divide it by 3x by under root x then plus 2 divided by under root x in the next step we will take the denominator to the numerator and it is under root x and under root means 1 over 2 but when it will go in the numerator the sign will be negative 1 over 2 same thing we will do for the next term to multiply by this is x 1 over 2 but when it will come in the numerator it will be negative 1 over 2 dx now see this is x this is x we will add the power so this has one power this is half so it will be positive 1 over 2 and it will remains the same dx now we have two terms and both terms have this constant. So I told you if you have a constant you have to write down outside the integral sign. And then x raised to power 1 by 2 dx plus 2 is the constant. We have to write down outside the integral sign x raised to power or exponent minus 1 over 2 dx. Now in the next step we are going to remove the integral sign. And how we will remove it? Just add 1 to the exponent exponent we have 1 over 2 we have to add 1 1 increment our new exponent will be 1 over 2 plus 1 2 same thing negative 1 over 2 is the exponent we have to add 1 our new power is 1 over 2 positive 1 same thing you have to write down in the denominator plus constant of integration as well in this step so here we are going to simplify it. It will be 3x raised to power 3 by 2 divided by 3 over 2. Here we have a double reciprocal but do not worry about it. It is very easy. Same thing 1 over 2 plus c. I will do one more step. This 2 will multiply with 3. It will be 6 over 3x raised to power 3 over 2. This 2 will multiply with 2 which is equal to 4x raised to power 1 over 2 plus 6 plus c sorry 3 1 time 3 2 times 6 2x raised to power 3 over 2 plus 4 exponent 1 by 2 plus constant of integration and this is our answer. So in this question you have learned that if suppose you have 3 terms or 4 terms here we have only 2 terms divided by under root x it means you have to divide each and every term with the denominator then you have to take the power or the denominator to the numerator in the next step we have added the exponents of the same basis and then we did our integration but still any point is not clear you can ask me please subscribe to my channel as well sign my academy and thanks for watching